Well, dozens of trucks are being stopped at the Idaho-Washington border this week in a crackdown on cargo that threatens American culture, or agriculture, rather. KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey is live at the port of entry along Interstate 90. Jeff, what are inspectors looking for? Well, really anything from infested apples to invasive zebra mussels, truckers can inadvertently import a lot of pests and diseases that can hurt agriculture, and that is still Washington's number one industry. Semi-trucks already have to slow down for the scales of the port of entry, and this morning ag officers took advantage of the line here to talk with drivers carrying food or crops find out what they're carrying and then that that officer determines whether or not that truck should go through secondary uh, inspection. Agricultural officials decided to take a look inside this truck carrying seed potatoes from British Columbia. They want to make sure that any spuds that end up in Washington soil aren't contaminated. Verify where it came from so we check the paperwork. Look for any type of a quarantine disease or pest that we might be able to see in a visual inspection. Also, checking for dirt. Too much dirt on seed potatoes could introduce blight into Washington fields, so even arriving farm equipment is inspected for alien mud here at the checkpoint. This truck, carrying wheat from Azula, was inspected for insects. Semis from the East Coast searched for gypsy moths that, oddly enough, like traveling in the cozy confines of the engine compartment. We're looking for hitchhiking insects, insects that are on products, disease that most people don't may not notice. Federal agricultural officials are especially worried about Chinese-grown oranges crossing into the U.S. from Canada where there are fewer restrictions on foreign citrus products. What we're trying to prevent is a fruit fly carrying hosts from coming into California, Arizona, and Texas. Today, agricultural officials were also taking a close look at any of the boats being trucked into Washington state. They're worried about the spread of invasive zebra mussels, something that can affect irrigation and power production. Both of those things very important to Washington farmers. Reporting live in Liberty Lake, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.